Hello, my name is Markus Stork from Stork Bicycle and I'm the designer and uh, co-designer of the A2, our new time trial bike. Uh, the A2 uh, was specifically designed for the tree team Abu Dhabi, which uh, is uh, the team of Faris El Sultan, the 2005 uh, winner of uh, the Ironman Hawaii. And uh, we signed an agreement with him in uh, April and uh, I was uh, promising Faris to have in 2010 and own a uh, time trial bike for him, which is specifically made and designed for him. So we were sitting down, we had all the features uh, with a long wish list, and in May everything was finalized. We started to make the sketches, did the drawings, did all the R&D work, and then we said, okay, let's try to shoot to have it available to have the first look at Eurobike and that Faris could ride it in uh, Hawaii. So what you see here right now is our uh, prototype and on the other side we have the first rideable version. So uh, we tried to make the fastest bike and to have some uh, special um, technologies in the bike. First of all we have the new fork with an integrated brake system. So the fork including the brake has a weight of 310 grams and there is a carbon fiber leaf spring brake integrated in the fork. Then we have our new handlebar stem system, which we call Time Fighter in Deutsch, Zeitjäger, because we were inspired by an airplane from Second World War with the gas tanks, and it has this very slick aerodynamic design with this wing profile here. Uh, the weight of the handlebar, including armrest and extensions, is approximately 420 grams. We will offer it in different stem lengths and then uh, to adjusting uh, the armrest as well. And to adjust the height of it, there will be a special spacer, which is exactly in the shape of the head tube. Next feature is our seat post with a special seat clamp design. This is allowing an adjustment of 70 to 80 degree seat angle. And you see the DI2 battery pack uh, positioned here. So, and this little two mounts. So in the next step, we will have an aerodynamic bottle cage holder so you're just flopping the battery around and then mount it between those two bottles. Uh, the frame, as you noticed, is only for DI2, so it has all internal uh, wirings for the DI2 uh, group set. And also the rear brake, we design an integrated rear brake, again, a carbon fiber uh, leaf spring brake, which weighs 50 gram, which is a third of a regular brake. So it's very aerodynamic and you can adjust them. Here you have a few of the brake of the brake lever. So actually what it does is that the carbon fiber is flexing and it's being pulled back. We tested it four million times braking and we didn't have any failure with it. And in addition to that, on the bike we have a rear entry dropout and the rear entry dropout has a little screw in the center of the trap out here, so we could adjust the wheelbase as well as the track from the different wheels. So weight of the frame, the fork, the handlebar stem combo, the seat post and the brakes is 2,290 grams. And we are very happy that we managed that in four months and Faris could start on them in Hawaii. So please watch out and hold your thumbs for Faris. Thanks a lot.